And totally silent creepiness right now. Oh, yep, because now we're in the atmosphere, so there's no sound in space. Okay, shut up. Hey, no, that is a valid science fact. Have you ever been there? No, but new science... Have new you ever movie? heard space? New Star Trek it movie? It is raucous. New Star Trek movie impressed uh, me beyond all belief because they did It's didn't. definitely not new anymore. That was like a year ago. I liked it. It's definitely... It's like the, the newest of like 30. Okay, doesn't matter. Um, I liked it, and they didn't have sound in space, which made me feel like super cool, because I was like, look, they're actually Well, it they've right. been to space, so I trust them, as opposed to you, who hasn't heard the raucous noise of space. The raucous noise the of space. The raucous love Did making I fix of space. The angle of the ship yet? I wouldn't even try it. I think you just fucked it up by going away into this little menu. No, it looks like it's... It yeah, looks you're, like you're definitely, it's... You're definitely going to, to like back to Earth right now. You might want to go out of the ship. Oh. Yeah, you're, 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 going, oh. you're going straight down. Yep. <laughs> oh, God. You were tumbling that entire time. Oh, no. I was not again. That was awful. Um, I don't know how to fix this because the dimensions are all well, weird. Well, the good news is you have half fuel of tank left. Half a tank of fuel. I'm just going to hit God. T and see if that fixes it. T. Press T, guys. We're fucked and up. we'll just add that. Can we decouple? Yeah, we can. Oh, we do have decouple. All right, sweet. See, like, if we had the big engine now, at this point, it'd be I, awesome to use, because there's nothing else obstructing us, we can just launch in some direction. But we can never get more than 10 feet off the ground with that goddamn engine. Alright, well, we have not <laughs> stopped. I don't know where we're pointing anymore. Um, where's the... Oh, that's kind of cool. Or right. orbit. Yeah, I've got an idea. Let's just go back. Yep. Yep. Deal. The app is going Actually, down. I've got a better idea. Let's Let's get stuck in orbit. We're just gonna fling out off the earth like slingshot. No, other way, other way, and go that way. No, I didn't. I didn't want you to do that. Um, look, I stopped it. You stopped what? It's not. Oh, it's still pinwheeling a little bit. Yeah. Just, just be calm. Be chill. Yeah. Chilled. As soon as that turns green, I know I've made it around the earth, what the and hell? we'll be okay. This is our mission for orbit, I guess. It's getting a little more boring than crashing into the moon. Okay, but. well, we're launching one fuel tank <laughs> and one Orbiting rocket. with one fuel tank. Nope, other, other button, other button. Back to the ocean. Um, I think I stopped it again. You... Are we... We have so much fuel, man. Hey, guys. Jack here. So, at this part, someone walked into the room, and our audio is all messed up. So, I have a minute and four seconds to take up with this speaking. And because I wanted to, to uh, you know, make the most of this minute and four seconds, uh, I would like to teach you something I learned on a random Wikipedia article I pulled up. Just random article. Here we go. Super numerary nipple. A supernumerary nipple, also known as a third nipple, triple nipple, accessory nipple, polythelia or the late condition polysmastia, is an additional nipple occurring in mammals including humans. Often mistaken for moles, supernumerary nipples are diagnosed at a rate of 1 in 18 in males and 1 in approximately 50 female humans. Aww. Famous people with this are Carrie Underwood, Carrie Underwood, Mark Wahlberg, Marky Mark, Anne Boleyn, second wife to Henry VIII. And in folklore, an extra nipple was held to be indicative that the woman concerned was a witch, the nipple being used to suckle the devil. Thank you. So that's what the rabbi said to the priest. Ah, <laughs> that was incredibly <laughs> racist and offends my people. I'm the Jewish one, you two. Your mom's Jewish. Well, that would be indicative of me being Jewish. You're a dick. Oh, I we probably could just speed up. A little oh, there we go. Because I'm I, like this should be orbit. It looks I'm not thrusting and I'm not thrusting. I'm thrusting. And now we're really far away from the planet, and we can speed up again. Wee! And again. I wish I could do this in real life. Whoa! And then we slow down because we're look like we're about to hit the. Do earth. you ever need to like avoid the Earth or like? Oh, I clicked. Oh. Did I click? Wait. So are we fucked? Oh, we're not. No. So we're gonna like zoom by the ocean. We're on the other side of the moon. The Earth? Earth. Wait, we have fuel left, you know that, right? Uh-huh. So we could, like, launch straight. We're going really fast, Yeah, we're definitely going to hit the Earth, I feel like. There's no, no way we're going to... Look oh, at that beautiful... Wow. That's a pretty good orbit. Sunrise. This is, like, the most organized thing we've done in this game. Because we just kind of launched and then left it. I like how we can't see the Earth. It's just kind of like... Yeah, it's just kind of, like, unrendered, like, it's just, crap. It's just shiny. <laughs> 
I mean, I guess it makes sense. It's like dark. It's just lack of rendering. Can it can it be bright? I think yet? I feel like this isn't all ocean either. This is just the boring. Re- like this is like there was like five pixels that he needed to do. Yeah, I mean, l- look. Oh, oh an right, island. Right. Oh, there's an island. Maybe that was all ocean. Oh, there. See a little better. Or maybe it was just night or something. I think it was just bored. I don't know. So we're on day thirty-five. We're on like day one, uh-huh. hour four, of our. Like, what's the plan now? Like, all right, plan, I, guys. I think the plan is to just aim at the Earth and blast into the Earth. Yeah. But where should we penetrate? Where, where's the station? Or the thing? Is there? Is that it? Maybe. Like, right, like, there. I'm just going to... I don't want to risk it. I'm just going to aim, like, straight at the Earth. Oh, yeah. Because all I have to do is screw up the orbit enough that, uh... Oh, oh, stop it. No, wait. How are we rotating? God damn it. I don't... I don't know. I'm... Like heinous sides of the wall with like their backs. Oh, I fixed it. Come on. Right into the earth. Penetrate. I think that is a, that is where we took off, isn't it? Maybe. Alright, well we're still flying real quick. And is that like into the earth? Yep, let's just Yeah, I mean that, 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 that's what that globe is for on the thing. Let's pray. We double live. No, that will hit the earth really hard. No, no we, we don't have a parachute. We should so. go add an angle so we like bounce around and like land. We can't. We don't have a parachute. <laughs> but if we hit it a shallow enough angle, oh, we ran out of fuel. <laughs> so we're stuck in over it. <laughs> awesome. Must be decouple. We're still stuck in it. I mean, we can decouple straight down, and we're just probably not. It was a little momentum towards the earth. Fine. Woo! So what's our what's our uh, map now? Computer. Yep, we're fucked. <laughs> Well, we I want to warp faster, damn it. So at, th- th- there are times when we can warp faster because we get higher. Right? Yeah, th- when you go to the moon <laughs> and you get like way out of the atmosphere, you can go a thousand times as fast. You can't see it, but the pod is like right there. It comes out and it's like green or something like oh, that. Oh, and now we have to slow down. Yep, see, we go too low and lose our time. And there's an island. All right, well, this is no longer productive. <laughs> it has been productive for a while now. <laughs> when we decided to launch with one rocket and one <laughs> fuel tank. And no fins. No parachute. No, no fins, no parachute. Um, well, we didn't need a parachute, see? <laughs> and as usual, these two are freaking out because they're r- orbiting forever. And just like farm. If this was Earth, chances are you'd hit a satellite or something oh, yeah. and just explode or bounce back towards Earth? Probably or not. Both. Oh, wait, now, now they're both fine. No, Jebediah, well, they're never happy. Jebediah has, like, more us. He's happy. Why is he in the middle? Look, <laughs> lift off. off. Separation of stage two. Yeah, but One day and seven hours in. It's the only time they heard from them. <laughs> stage two worked, guys. All right. All right. Are you coming home? No. How, how is that engine we gave to you that uses, like, liquid uranium? Oh, it's fine.